Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. I know I'm a little bit late tonight. I apologize. I'm hoping some of you guys will come and hang out with me. Hi. Hi, D. Yay. Some of you guys are still awake. <laughs> Let me move. I'm going to adjust my... Adjust my phone here a little bit. Zoom in a little bit. Hi, everybody. Oh, I'm so excited that everybody's joining in. Hi, everyone. Yeah, it's not super late here either. It's just later than later than normal. Hello, everyone. I'm so excited that you are here. Hi. Hello. Hello, hello. Let me turn on my my laminator here. I'm excited that you're still awake, D. You weren't here with us last night. I missed my friend. Okay, so tonight we have some fun things to talk about. Um, we have some housekeeping to do, and then we're going to do some foiling. We're going to do some coloring and some foiling, and I'm really excited about that because um, I love foiling, and I get to show you guys a sneak peek of something tonight, which I'm really excited about. So um, first and foremost, a lot of you guys sent me an email. And I appreciate it. Uh, a lot of uh, folks that are not subscribers to other products, and they would like to be able to get all of the um, all of the digital stuff as well for one low monthly price. So we now have um, a subscription uh, for that. So if you would like, uh, when you click down the link below, um, it's $10 a month. That is the introductory price. Obviously, it will change at some point because $10 is really cheap uh, to get all of, <laughs> all of the uh, cut files every month that we come out with. Um, my promise to you is that there will always be 50 new cut files every single month if you are a subscriber to that uh, to that. So that means that uh, for $10 a month, you get all of the cut files. And obviously, we uh, will have additional information about that in the future. But there are a lot of folks that don't subscribe um, <clears throat> to other things uh, because they only do stuff with Cricut and Silhouette and, and stuff like that because you guys met me that way, some of you. So uh, that is available now. So you can get all of our digital files for $10 a month, which if you download, I mean, five files, you paid for it. Um, also, uh, we have a new product tonight. Something that I've been dying, uh, <laughs> dying to share with you. Um, so, yeah, we're going to have um, like a tier thing coming at some point, but I won't talk about that right now because that's, you know, in the future. Uh, but yeah, I'm excited. Um, no, hey, if you're a subscriber for other things, that is, um, you are good to go. You are good to go. That's just for people who don't subscribe to other things. Okay? Hi, Stevie. Yes, Gail. I will be giving you a peek of the three new foils. I'm excited to give you a peek. So, um, that's not the new product for the night yet, though. They aren't showing free tonight for me. Okay, Penny. There are some things that um, have to be added to the category. Uh, as we switched over to the new subscription tier situation um, with that new $10 tier, things are still filtering back in. So don't worry, Penny. If you check back tomorrow, everything will be free again. Okay? So the thing that I'm excited to share with you tonight are our brand new Halloween aqua pigments 
So if you are a Brutus Monroe Aqua Pigment collector, oh Chrissy, I, I'm excited about it too. A Brutus Monroe Aqua Pigment collector, these are for you. There are only a hundred of these being made, a hundred sets. That is it. Once the hundred sets of them are gone, they are gone. Um, oh, there's a new section at the top, Carol, that says uh, digital at the very top of BrutusRenaud.com. So these are only, we are only, like I said, making a hundred of these. So if you go and you try to grab a set of them and they're gone, unfortunately they're gone. Um, we are not making more than a hundred sets. Uh, so they are limited edition. So the three different colors that you get in the set... Um, yes, it, this is a different color than what's in the Halloween box, though, but it is, uh, it is the same bottle, yes. So, um, yes, Jessica, all the boxes, with the exception of the ones that had, um, some of the ones that had the pumpkin spice, because it's a back order, but it is due back to be, uh, back in tomorrow. So, all of them should ship tomorrow. Well, should finish shipping tomorrow, if that makes sense. If it was going past tomorrow, which I believe is Wednesday, yeah. If it went past tomorrow, we were going to give everybody a call and we were just going to start shipping things. Uh, but it is due back tomorrow. Um, so, the three different um, aqua pigments you get are called Pumpkin Guts, Nightshade, and Witch's Brew. So, you get three brand new colors that have never been released before, obviously, with Brutus Monroe. Um, and you get them in these um, these bottles. So, they are skull bottles. Whoopsies. And um, they're about 1.28 fluid ounces. So, they are more than... Um, I don't know. You might have to re... Uh, Roy, you might have to reset... Um, because it's not buffering on my side. And usually if it's not buffering on my side, then it means, uh, then it might be something on your side, my friend. Um, okay. So these are the three colors. Again, we have Pumpkin Guts, Nightshade, and Witch's Brew. Um, on the bottom of yours, mine do not have them on the bottom yet because, um... That's just the way that I get them, unfortunately. Uh, they will have a little sticker, a little circle sticker that will tell you the name of them. Okay? And... That's them. So I'm really excited uh, about these guys, and we're going to use these soon uh, in a video. So we're going to use these very, very soon. But for now, I'm putting them up on my shelf because I love, love, love. And you might be able to hear them going up on my shelf. I just love the way they look. <laughs> what's the name of the aqua pigment? Um, what's the name of the aqua pigment in the Halloween box? I'm going to have to look. I can't remember what the name of it is because we designed it so long ago, but I'll have to take a look. Oh, and I forgot to tell you the price of these. So it's $29.99 for the set of three. But if you are a subscriber, I'm pretty sure you get a really amazing price on these. I can't, I don't know exactly what the price is, but I'm sure someone will be able to tell us. But I know you get a really phenomenal price on them. So, okay. So now let's get to foiling. So if you got the Halloween box, let's start with these ones because... Because these are the ones that um, that I, I'm going. One of the ones that I'm going to use. Well, I'm going to we're going to foil a couple of them. But um, so these ones from the Halloween box are now available for everyone. So if you um, if you did not get a chance to get the Halloween box, or if you got the Halloween box and you love these panels oh so much, you can now get them separately. So let me go ahead and open them up. They are linked down below. If you love vintage Halloween, you are going to want to grab these panels. I would say grab a couple of packs of them. I know I grabbed a couple for myself. So first and foremost, we have the ones that have the Hoot of Owl, a few droplets to enhance fear and dread. Use with caution. Distilled Beetlejuice, shake before use. Witch's Grade, Black Cat's Hiss, Keep Chilled, All Natural. <laughs> I just think that these are absolutely hilarious. Um, simple simple Use, Ashes of Vampire, Deadly, 100% Sunburned Vampire. Oh my goodness, I love these. And then this was a decoration that my grandma, these are all actually vintage decorations that my grandma had in her house, and I absolutely loved it. Halloween was a really, really big deal at our house when we were little, at my grandma's house. It was a really, really big event. So um, 
these, just imagine these as a background. You can also use your scan and cut and cut them out. I designed them so they were separate, so you could do that. Um, also, I love this black cat. I couldn't get... Oh, D. Um, there's no picture for it, so I apologize for that. It's the item that says Halloween... Uh, here, I'll just post it. Hold on one second. I will post it, my friend. Um... They are Halloween panels. There is no photograph for them yet. I was, uh, I tried to put the photograph, um, I tried to put the photograph to, uh, there, but unfortunately it wasn't taking tonight. Um, so let me see if I can grab you. I, I believe it's card panel. Let's see. Ooh, my goodness, you guys are grabbing those aqua pigments. My goodness, thank you, thank you, thank you. I hope you love them as much as I do. Oh, they're called Trick or Treat Card Panels. Hold on one second. I will paste it. I apologize, there is no photo right now. Um, I promise, as soon as it will allow me to put a photo, it was not taking um, tonight. So, I know, I love that, especially the special bottles. Okay, so there's these panels, and then last but not least, are these super cool bats. Isn't that super cool? I absolutely love them. Love them, love them. So those are the panels, and we're going to uh, be doing some foiling on these tonight. Then these are the panels that are also now available from the box. So if you got the inspiration box, and Carolyn, I know these are already on their way to you because I saw the order go in today because I have to sign off on all of those. So anytime that there's an issue with shipping or a box, I sign off on them before they go out. Um, even if I'm on vacation, I still sign off on them. So uh, I uh, want to always make sure that I know if there's ever any issues and that we can fix it. So they're on their way to you. Um, so these are the panels from the box and these are the ones that we're gonna color tonight. Oh my goodness, look at that. I can't wait to foil that. Then, uh, so this one has the leaves and the acorn. Hi, Belinda. These ones have leaves and acorns and little buckeyes. And it's just really, really cool. This one has, oh, look how cool this is with the, oh, I know this one. Now I remember designing this one. This one goes with the stamp, the stamp add-on. See, I'll show you. Oh, good, Belinda. You'll have to post pictures. So I'll show you. So you can use them together. Isn't that cool? And the, it's fall. Y'all fits inside of there. I forgot that. Oh, my goodness. I designed these things so long ago. Can you guys believe that I just got finished designing Easter for next year? I know. Easter. Easter. Craziness. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, and then my favorite out of all of the panels. Oh, let me put this over here because I want to use it next week. This one. How fun is that? And again, these can all be foiled. Um, yes, this stamp is still available. Um, Carolyn, the new foils are not available yet. I can't tell you when they're available. Um, I can tell you that... Um, it's one of my favorite days of ever on the calendar. If you can think of what that day could possibly be, uh, that's when they will be available. Okay, so that is that one. I love this. Okay, so are you guys ready for a peek of my brand new foils? They said I was allowed... They said I was allowed to share with you my to share with you a sneak peek of the foils. So are you ready to see them? I can't tell you the date. Nope, it's sooner, sooner than Halloween. I can tell you that. Okay. So the first one, you guys knew I had to have this one because it's my favorite color. 
Uh, the name of the stamp set is... Fall Y'all. If you search for BRU5239, that will bring it up too. We had to do orange. <laughs> and of course it would uh, close right there. So orange is one of the colors, of course. We had to have orange, right? I mean, it only makes sense that we have orange. Okay. And of course, there's going to be a full video where I teach you and show you all about these foils. This is just the... Um, this is just the little teaser... So this is just the, the little, you know, the little teaser of what it is. So this one goes with my sketch line of foils, because you guys know I have the sketch line of foils, right? So, love it, you make things so difficult for those of us that love orange. I know I love orange too. So this is uh, part of the sketch collection. But then, oh, they sure can, Gail. That's actually what we're going to do tonight. So now I have a brand new collection. So, I love my sketch collection, right? I mean, obviously, the sketch collection has been very good to me. But I now have a new collection, and I have two colors. So, I have three foils coming. Um, and this is called the Static Collection. Are you ready? It's a very different type of foil. You guys know that I'm, you know, I'm different, right? I hope this one can help me, because I, I try to be different. So this is, I'll introduce you to the static collection. So we have a red static. And again, uh, you might be able to, um, it's gonna be kind of hard to see it on screen. I'll try to bring it up closer. Look at how it moves, it's very 3D. Yes, I can tell you that my release this time is Christmas and Halloween. They allowed me to do Christmas and Halloween. Okay, so we have red, and then there was another color that was missing from my collection. So now if you've been following along with the, the Brutus Monroe collection of foils, we have a green, we have a purple, we have a silver, we have an orange, we have a red, and then there was one that was missing for the holidays. Can you guys guess what color that could be? Uh, we have one um, in purple. It doesn't look like that, but we do have a purple. Have you seen the purple foil, Jessica? I don't even know that I have one here to show you. But here's what the green looks like. Oh, I can't wait to put them all together. Okay. That's why I called it static, Heidi. Okay, so last but not least, something that we really needed for the holidays that you're going to see me use a lot is gold. Look, has a holographic to it. Oh, isn't it beautiful? So we have the gold, we have the red, and we have the orange. So, I mean, it's a good release, you guys. I think it's a really good release. Okay, so let's move these guys out of the way because we are going to start with the... Um, we're gonna start with the orange. Oh, does it? Yeah, it's really, I mean, the the foils, I mean, luckiest guy in the world. I know I've said that to you guys before, but I am the luckiest guy in the whole entire world to have a line with deco foil. They are so good to me. Um, they take very good care of me, and I absolutely love them. Really do. I am so incredibly fortunate and blessed to have a line of products with them uh and i told you guys this previously that literally just a couple of uh years ago i was in um i was at the local michaels buying deco foil because i was obsessed absolutely obsessed with the idea of what it could do and now here we are. Sorry, I'm rummaging through my box of things here because I need some purple tape. 
Found it. All right. So let's move this over. I know I love the orange sketch. So the orange sketch is the first one we're going to use tonight. All right. So let's see here. Oh my goodness, are you guys snatching up those aqua pigments? Thank you, thank you, thank you. I can't wait to see what you do with them. So, what I think we're going to do is I think we're going to do the owls first. Uh, because I just want to have them as a background because I'm going to be making a card tomorrow with Halloween. So actually, let's do the owls and let's do the cats. Because I want to show you how these work. So if you have never done foiling before, this will give you an idea. Um, I don't have that Gemini heating machine. Um, you can transfer it just with a... Um, <clears throat> excuse me, with tape, with any type of adhesive. Uh, this foil is actually not used for the Gemini machine. This foil is actually used um, with like a laminator. Oh, that's cool, Renee. That's really cool. All right, so I'm just gonna trim down my foil here. Thank you, Donna. All right. Oh, Penny. Darn it. I knew I was forgetting something. I do not. But if you do purchase them tonight or grab them tonight, that I'm using them tomorrow. <laughs> so that's why I'm actually foiling these tonight because I will be using the new Simple Blinds tomorrow. But I can promise you that they are incredible. I mean, I know that you'll just have to take my word for it, <laughs> but I promise you they are really, really awesome. They're really, really great. The pictures of those should be on the website. I know Shane was burning the midnight oil to get those on tonight uh, before he left, so you should, uh, should be able to see those on the website. I'm hoping you're able to cover some parchment I don't know if I brought any parchment home so I might just have to use let's see here might just have to use a regular piece of paper oh they're there okay yeah I'm sorry I don't have them with me I don't have them with me tonight Am I back? All right, I'm just grabbing a piece of cardstock here. Oh, Donna, wait until you see what I have up my sleeves. Just you wait. I have big plans for foil. <laughs> All right, so I'm just placing it in here. As you guys have seen the foil before, always pretty side um, up, okay? And then we just tap it down to make sure everything's in there. And then I'm just sending it through my laminator. Um, the laminator is off screen because I don't want to bore you with that. I foiled and colored one of your watercolor prints and made a great birthday card. <gasps> Wendy, diff oh wait, hold on D. I missed what you said. I'm scrolling up, hold on. Wait, what did you ask D? Ask again, my friend, I didn't see it. It went by way too quick. All right, so the first one. Oh no, it shifted. That's okay. I'm gonna run it through again. I don't know, I think my, I don't think my laminator got hot enough because I, I can feel that it's not hot. Just shifting my phone a little bit here. I think my laminator might have finally, finally bit the dust. Oh, 
of the name of the stamp is Fall You All, or you put in BRU5239. Uh, oh, now it's getting hot enough. Okay, are you guys ready? <sighs> Every time. And I missed a spot here and here, but that's okay. Did you go back? Oh, D, if you're a subscriber, you get all the cut files for free. Completely free. That was all it was. The fall printed tags. Yes, we are working on those, Donna. Um, we have a new, um, we have a new manufacturer for those. Well, we're working on a new manufacturer for those. So my, my, my hope is that you will see those very soon. We have a couple of new manufacturers we're working with because we're bringing, again, as much back to the U.S. as we can. Um, <clears throat> uh, well, thank you, D. Yeah, as long as you're a subscriber, you get all of our cut files completely free now. Because I love y'all so much. Okay. So I think it's because this cardstock was too thick. Let's try it again. But this time we're going to do it with the owls. So let's pop this in. And I promise you, you're going to get 50 cut files a month from me. So hold me accountable, please. Just don't yell at me in front. Um, yes, Dawn, if you are a subscriber... Uh, I guess I forgot to mention that to you guys. Your subscription benefits got that much better. Um, they are, Heidi. Yep. If you are a subscriber, you get all of the cut files completely free now. And my new goal is to give you 50 brand new ones every single month. Um, and they're all going to be designed by me. Oh, say a prayer for me. Um, 50 cut files a month. But I love designing cut files. That's, I come from a world of cut files. Um... That's where I got my start, so I'm really excited to do uh, cut files again. It's one of my favorite things to do. Hopefully, did I zoom out or did... Oh, here we go. I was like, what the heck? Okay, so this one definitely got hot enough. Um, correct, Belinda. Um, there are some SVGs that still need to be, um, I'm going to actually run this through this way too, real quick. There are some SVGs that need to be updated. So if you, um, got charged for one, just shoot Heather an email. We'll issue you a virtual gift card for that one. Um, there are some <coughs> that still, that are still being, um, put into that list if that makes sense. Not all of them have transferred over yet. So if they have, if you are a subscriber and you are seeing one that's not free yet, hi, Lisa. If you're seeing one that is not free yet, don't buy it because it will be free for you by Friday. There's a lot of digital cut files. I mean, there's a lot in there. There's over a hundred right now. Um, and my goal by the end of the year is to have over a thousand because we are going to have a different plan available, but I'll unveil that to you when the time comes. Um, but when that time comes, I'll tell you about it, but it's not ready for right now. Um, but like I said, I think you're really gonna, really gonna love it. Okay. You sure do, Roberta. Completely free. Oh, wow. Look at that one. That is so cool. Wow. Sorry, I was busy staring at it because I am. Um, Donna, well, I'm definitely going to do at least two. Oh, I'm glad to see, D, that's all that matters, you're happy. <laughs> That's all that matters is that you're happy. Okay, so what we're going to do now is put these to the side because we are going to use these. I love these pre-printed cards. 
if there's none available, I apologize. <laughs> it's because I bought them all. All right, so we're going to make the quickest card you'll ever see. Are you ready? So let's go ahead and color this guy. So I'm going to grab my marker stand because my marker stand, to anyone that's just joining in, um, as of right now, these are um, just about halfway sold out. These are our new limited edition Halloween aqua pigments. If you get, um, if you purchase these, they are, you get three colors. You get uh, Pumpkin Guts, um, Nightshade, and Witch's Brew. Oh, no. Hold on. Let me stop everything for my sister. Yes, Hez, what, what can I help you with? <laughs> Hi, Bob. So these are, um, yes, sister, what can I help you with? She's. It's like she's like we're toddlers again, and she's in the back screaming. Hello? Hello? Pay attention to me. Okay, so these are the three colors. Oh, she said that is all. All right, so let me move these out of the way. We're a little about, about halfway sold through those. So if you are purchasing um, after I am no longer live and they're not there, I'm sorry, they're all gone. They are limited. Uh, they are a limited release. Um, and uh, once they're gone, they're gone. So if you are a collector of all things Brutus Monroe, especially all things Brutus Monroe when it comes to aqua pigments, you're going to want to grab these because I can tell you right now, if for nothing else, they look really, really good on your shelf. <laughs> really, really good on your shelf. Uh, I just looked at them on my shelf. And plus, when they're all gone, you have a really, really cool jar. And we have some other little goodies that will be coming out later in the month um, that will be available in the skull jar. They won't be aqua pigments, but you will see what they are. Okay, so let's go ahead and color this guy, shall we? Oh, um, Hez. Since you now have my undivided attention, can you um, grab the link for this marker stand and post it? Thanks, Renee. Oh, it could, Penny. I'm excited to share with you those simple blends tomorrow. I have big plans for them. Uh, this is, it's if you just look up marker stand has... Because we just got another shipment of them in because you guys bought them in like two seconds again. All right, so let's start with the leaves here. All right, because I want to show... Um, she, she said she's doing her nails. She's always doing her nails. Because I want to show... Okay, wait, don't tell me. I want to show Gail. Was it Gail? Gail, were you the one that asked me? I think it was Gail. I want to show Gail how we can foil these after. We do not. Uh, we do not carry tracing paper. That's something we could definitely get, though. Thank you, Hez. All right, so we're just going to go in and gently color these. Uh, I was going to zoom in on my computer screen. I was like, zooming in on your computer screen, Christopher, isn't going to help them to see. Oy vey. I get so excited about the new products, I forget how to do simple tasks. Okay, so let's go in and color in these leaves. And then we'll use a darker, maybe yellow ochre. I mean, you can see how easy it is to color these in. These are Arteza or Arteza markers. I say it Arteza because I feel like Arteza sounds real refined. Even though, I mean, you can get a whole set of markers for... Like, I think this whole set's like 120 bucks. Oh, D, I love it. You can watercolor these, absolutely. Use your aqua pigments, definitely. Oh, wait, let's do this leaf down here, too, before I get too carried away. And again, you can be... 
messy or not messy, it's really up to you. Then I'll grab the yellow ochre. Oopsies. Got to grab by the marker, Christopher. All right, so let's go ahead and add in And this is just a little bit darker. We don't want it to be too much darker. We just want it to give. Oh, they are. Um, yes, they are the same as Spectrum Noir. And no, they are. Um, they're the Everblend alcohol markers. And I mean, I've been enjoying them. They're, they're good. I mean, they're great for the price point. Uh, but as you guys know, and I've hinted to you guys, if you have a trick up my sleeve that's coming very soon, hopefully before the holiday, hopefully before the holidays, that's our goal. But we are at the mercy of the, we are at the mercy of the manufacturer, as always. Okay. Oh my goodness, those, those aqua pigments are flying. I know you guys love when we do a limited release, but you guys really love when we do a limited release. I'm just excited that you guys like them because to get those custom bottles, Let's just say I had to order a lot of bottles. <laughs> I had to order a lot of bottles. So, thank you for loving them. And we'll do these red too. Because again, we're creating our own ending. We can do whatever we want, right? All right, so let's go in and color this one now. I can't, can't wait to see how you guys color these in. I have a feeling that uh. I'm gonna see some really beautiful panels from you guys. And again, I'm, just, I'm kind of messy coloring because I think that's part of the beauty of these. Don't hit us too hard right before Christmas. Oh, Linda, I would never spoil those little, spoil those babies. I mean, I say that now, but I do have some tricks up my sleeves. <laughs> but you know me, I like to, um, the owls come in the trick-or-treat pack. All right, so I'm going to add a little bit of a darker shade to this one. Again, create your own ending. Add the shade the way that you like it. No problem, my friend. And I can tell you we are at SOS status uh, for the, uh, the Trick or Treat Pack. We are at, and um, I believe she's, I know she's going to start calling about the anniversary party. I believe the anniversary party is Friday. And then the, um, I got glue on myself. Uh, and then the... Christmas boxes, I believe, are Monday. So make sure to be uh, to be near your phone because I know um, I know that the Christmas boxes are going to go really quick. I can tell you they're definitely going to go really quick because I just saw the full contents of it today and it's a good one. Really good one. There's lots of goodies in that box. If you love the Halloween box, you are going to really love. <laughs> I can't wait for the anniversary party either. It's going to be a big one this year. It's going to be a big one. I can tell you that much. I have definitely 
let's just say I've pulled out all the stops this year. It's going to be our biggest event ever. Five years. My goodness. I did not think. I didn't think we were going to make it five months. And I've told you guys that before. And I'm not trying to sound like, you know. I don't even know what the term would be of what the people would try to sound like, but I am 100% being honest with you when I tell you that. I honest to goodness did not think we were going to make it five months. I didn't think we were going to make it five weeks. Yes. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited about the, the anniversary party. I mean, we have a lot of fun at the creature and ending event, but the creature and ending event is much more laid back. Whereas the uh, anniversary party is a little more black tie, without being black tie. Yes, yeah, so many celebrations in December. Yes. Did you guys know that I walked my sister down the aisle? That's what we could, that's a celebration for us too. I did. I walked her down the aisle. Okay, and I also made sure that there wasn't even a thing out of place. Not even a thing out of place at that wedding. She'll tell you I was crazy. I was cuckoo about making sure her wedding was perfect. All right, so I think we're going to do a brighter yellow. Whoops. Did it again. Heidi, I did not see your question. Hold on. Um, they go on sale. I believe she's gonna start calling on Friday. I have to ask her though. She hasn't been getting notifications. Are we gonna be able to buy the Christmas box on the website? You'll be able to buy it on the website. Heather's going to call first because that's what she always does. That's her promise. And my promise to you is that um, you'll get a call first. Um, and if you're on her list, then she'll give you a call and you'll be able to get it. Um, if not, it will be available on the website too. Just can't guarantee. I just can't guarantee that it won't be gone, obviously, before if you don't know. Um, uh, no, she was a Christmas, uh, December bride. 12, 13, 14 is her anniversary. Just can't guarantee. I think I'm going to add a little green in here because I think that's what it needs. Just a hint of green. And we'll do some green berries over here so we can carry that over. I just think it needs a little bit of green. Do you guys love how I'm obsessed with my marker case? But are you gonna you don't put your markers back into the marker case? Um oh okay, Heidi, perfect. They're not fire, yeah, we were. So I have to go tomorrow to Padco. Do you guys remember uh, me telling you about the the frame shop that is the the cha one chapter? Um... Oh, I love him so much, Don. Oh, I love him. Oh my goodness, do I love him so much that I want to do a stamp uh, of a of that little guy. Those blue eyes, my word. Um. I'm going to get my stamp timber stamp framed. I'm actually thinking of going and getting the deco foil. I want to get a couple of things framed. Do you guys think that's cheesy? I don't know if it's cheesy. Is it cheesy to go and get that kind of stuff framed? I love it. I think it's, I don't know. I don't know if it's cheesy. Is it cheesy? 
go get that stuff framed. Uh, Donna, you send an email to heather at brutusmonroe.com. But I want to go and get those types of things framed. Like, I want to go get, um... I want to go get the color burst framed. Because that was, uh, our first... Our first big product collab was color burst. Then the steel. I feel like I just need... I feel like that kind of stuff. I don't know. I just feel like... I know I don't want to be cheesy, but... It's an accomplishment, right? I think it is. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I forgot to put this marker away. Oh, and this marker. Oh, my word. Get it together, Christopher Allen. I just get so excited about new products. You'll see if you come to the store, we do have a lot of, we do have a lot of stuff framed. Um, but... Yeah, I think we will get it framed. I think we will. By golly, I think we will. Actually, I should probably give it to my mom to get a frame for me because she's always looking for Christmas gifts, and that's like the easiest, most perfect Christmas gift. <laughs> okay. All right, so what I think we are going to do this one with is, I think we'll use the new gold. What do you think? I think we should use the new gold. Yeah. Oh, I love that D. All right, so let's do the gold. So you guys can see what it looks like. She'll be trying to get these foils for her nails. Oh, I love this gold. I know that Michael just placed the, the order for all of these, so they will be ready for launch day. Can't tell you when that day is yet, but I can tell you it's coming. All right. So let's go ahead and cut this guy down. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Where did I put my... I have a piece of vellum that I was using that worked out really well. And now, I've... oh, here it is. Well, here's another piece of vellum. This will work. This will work. So I want to show, is my Gail still here? Gail, are you still here, my love? I want to show you what this looks like. All right. I just want to make sure it doesn't shift. All right, it's in. Tell you the day of the week. I cannot. I can't. I can just tell you it's soon. That's all I can tell you. <laughs> I can tell you it's soon, so don't worry. It is soon. Oh my goodness, you guys are snatching up these aqua pigments. I kind of want to use them on something. No, we won't use them on anything tonight. I just love these colors. Mm -mm -mm. I promise I will be shouting it from the rooftop, though. Oh, that would be awesome, D. It, yes, Heidi, that is correct. It ends in a Y. All right, I'm going to send this puppy through one more time. Because it's, um, yeah, I can swatch them. Uh, Belinda, I actually already have them swatched. But I could swatch them again because I lost where my swatches are on my desk. But I will definitely swatch them for you. They're very pretty. Very Halloween-y. Oh, 
Oh, good, you're still here. Perfect. All right, so let's peel her off. Oh, my goodness. I am in complete shock and awe. Okay, hold on. Do you guys see this? And it has this cool, like, striation effect. It almost looks like glitter. I'm hoping that the light is picking that up. Sorry. Oh, I guess it happened again. I got mesmerized by it. I don't even know how to explain it to you. I mean, I know that you're seeing it, but it almost looks like glitter. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, sorry you guys aren't going to be able to get any foil because it's all mine. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> all right. So let me swatch these out for you real quick. So we are going to start with Pumpkin Guts. This guy is called Pumpkin Guts. And oh, okay, so there's the first one. Remember, aqua pigments are completely non-toxic, so you don't have to worry about touching them and using them and so on and so forth. And you don't have to worry about the kids. That was very important to me because I like to aqua pigment paint with Joey and Emma. And the only way I could do that is if they were non-toxic. So that is Pumpkin Guts. Then we have Nightshade. And again, these are at SOS status. Oh, I have not heard of a store called Storables, but I would love to go. That is Nightshade. Ooh, that's pretty too. And then last but certainly not least, we have Witch's Brew. And again, these are very Halloween-y colors. Look at how beautifully that saturates the paper. Oh my word. Isn't that cool? And again, you can always use these with a stencil. Um, there are so many different things you can do with these. Uh, but these are, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to look it up. I love them. I love them, love them. Very Halloween-y. Like I said, you can use them with a stencil. So let me show you here real quick. I don't know why I keep saying real quick. I don't really, I don't have anywhere to be. Um, so you would grab your stencil like so. This is the one that Minnie tried to eat. Let me move this up a little bit so you can see. Still buffering. I can see on my end. Is it coming back? I'm gonna show you how you can use these. So let's do let's do some nightshade. So all I do is I take some nightshade or any aqua pigment in this case, it just happens to be nightshade. I always use my um, round block because it's my favorite. And what I do is I just let my little blending tool soak up that pigment, okay? So we're gonna let it soak it up, kind of dab it a little bit. It will soak up into there. There we go. See how much that's soaked up into there? Oh my goodness, Lisa. So now all I'm doing is going in and gently tapping and dabbing. The aqua pavement, again, I am using nightshade. Oh yes, that was it, Donna. Um, that one is called, uh, I believe that one's called Hocus Pocus. I have to look because we do. We are going to have refills available for those for you. They're half ounce refills. 
Or they might be full ounce refills. I don't know. I have to look. I believe it's called Hocus Pocus. It has beautiful gold mica in it. Now I'm remembering. Thank you. Who was that? Thank you, Donna. Okay, are you ready for the big reveal? Look at how pretty that is. And the cool thing about the stencil is it was made to be able to be rotated. So now if I wanted to go on top of this with like a different color or with ink, I could. And it would look really cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that that's called um, Hocus Pocus. Isn't that cool? I love this stencil. I really do. So there we are. Mm. And to whomever asked me about other ways to foil, I'll show you real quick here. Just going to take a little bit of tape on top of here. I'm going to place it right here in the center. Then I'm going to grab my little tool here. Thank you. I drew them myself. <laughs> Then we'll go ahead and burnish that down. And then when you lift, this might not be dry completely. We'll do that again right up here because I don't have a long enough piece of foil, but that's okay. You can see you can add that extra little bit of glitz and glitter anywhere. Isn't that so cool? My favorite is to do it like on a dark piece of paper. So let me grab... Let me grab like a piece of launch bag. And I'll show you. Also on vellum is really pretty. Grab some more of this tape. Okay. Yes, I love those squeaky clean dispensers. that's that. Now we're going to use the gold since that's the one that we have left over from before. Oh wait. Let's just use this piece. And I'll show you how pretty it is on the darker as well. and we'll do this little piece right here make sure we got it all I think we did and now look at that I mean if that doesn't knock your socks off I don't know what will because when someone gets a card with something like that on it I know, me too. It's it's becoming uh, my new favorite. I mean, it's hard to pick a favorite. It's like having a favorite child, but it's definitely becoming my new favorite. It's just so cool. So, so pretty. Love you too, D. All right. Well, that is everything that I have for tonight. Um... Thank you. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a pretty incredible day, Carolyn. So thank you all so much for hanging out with me tonight. I adore each and every one of you. Thank you so much for being a part of my life. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I will be back tomorrow. Uh, obviously, I have lots of fun things to share with you tomorrow as well. We'll be making more cards. We'll be hanging out. We'll just be having the time of our lives. I hope you are um having fun too, uh, because I. Uh, have lots of things planned for us. So have a wonderful evening. Remember to create something every day, whether that is something with your brand new Halloween aqua pigments, or of course, 
your own ending. I love you all to pieces. Thank you so much for your support. I appreciate you all more than you will ever know. And I will see you guys very, very soon. Have a wonderful night, my friends. Goodbye.